Thank you, uh, Honorable Mr. Speaker, sir. I thank the Honorable Bokola Lumbure for the question. Mr. Speaker, sir, we know that micro, small, medium enterprises, MSMEs, are the backbone of our economy. They are essentially, essentially in every sector. As I have said earlier in this August House, we want to pay the same attention to community-based tourism businesses as we do any other. We want local communities to have full ownership and management of, of the business so that the economic benefits of tourism stay within their community. We have already seen a considerable appetite in resource owners wanting to be part of the sector. This could be a community up in the highlands who have unique traditions or a village on the coast of Savu Savu who wants to provide horseback riding. Mr. Speaker, sir, these communities have great potential to be included in the tourism value chain and fill gaps in the market the tourists actually want. To promote diversification and inclusivity, the Department of Tourism continues to visit communities in partnership with other government agencies such as the ITO KFS and MSME Fiji to provide technical advice on tourism development and identify needs to provide targeted assistance. We look to support businesses such as Mbauma Waterfalls through the program such as the Integrated Human Resource Development Program or IHATS, IHRDP. Mr. Speaker, sir, most recently, the Tourism Department and MSME Fiji visited 20 villages and about 50 tourism MSMEs in Nandronga, Mba, Tavua, Rakirake, and Itasiri, and Namosi provinces. The villages include Mbiao Sebu, Nakambuta, Lomawai, Ambada, Natalau, Tawa Village, Doloi Suva, Solebu, Yaro, and Sawani, to name a few. Some of the expected outcomes of the community awareness and engagement are take stock of current and potential tourism products, supporting infrastructure and services, and the needs of the communities. Advocate responsible tourism, such as child safety. Create awareness and advocate on the code of conduct for tourism service providers, which cabinet, cabinet recently endorsed, endorsed. Identify key barriers faced by MSMEs and communities in order to provide targeted assistance, such as training and access to finance. Promote ecotourism to provide, to promote our unique flora and fauna. Cultural diversity and adventure tourism, such as whale and dolphin watching, hiking, waterfall tours, as the best form of community-based tourism. Mr. Speaker, sir, the Ministry endeavors to continue this exercise in the coming months and years. Our immediate need is ensuring that we have a dedicated team to support community-based tourism work to better address the needs of the communities. Since taking, taking office, I have already spoken to a number of development partners, such as the Asian Development Bank and UNDP, to support the ministry in promoting more community-based tourism. Thank you, Mr. Speaker, sir.